was a dream that was real. It shall be realized. These are the wishes of Marcus Aurelius. Wait a minute. Oh, God damn it, game. Why can't you do that? Oh, uh, fuck. Does we have to do it like this? No. Yeah. Move all these to reserve. Make uh, make catapults. Look at the look at the troop count going down. Yeah. Like the charge in Rohirrim. Did it actually work like that? Since uh, it was horse archers versus Cav. It would. Oh, ima oh, imagine if someone like makes the Lord of the Rings mod and you can actually have a mammoth. Or no, not the mammoth, the Oliphant. What was it? Oliphant? Like the Easterlings? Or the... Wait a minute. Easterlings? And what the, what the hell is the other one? Audrey. Something on age. I can't remember. Our dream, yeah. Okay, both breaches are on the left side. Stay here. Archers. And you guys stay here. Ah oh, shit. Okay, I need the UI for this. Yeah, you there. You here. Maybe if I can manage to get it. The never mind. There's, it's impossible. So it makes the Lord Rings mod and you can replicate the battles in the... Oh, that's gonna be awesome. Oh yeah, I know. They sometimes lob a shot like right through and into the enemy infantry. That's behind walls. Look at this, this actually has fortifications inside as well. And archers on a... What's... Uh, what's uh, a fucking... And troops are on the... on the... on the... roofs of houses. Look at that, they are trying to hit them through the bridge. Sometimes they love a shot. But I do wonder if it's gonna be like possible to make it so you can actually like destroy the walls using the catapults like in the battle itself, not just besieging it down on the campaign map. That would be cool as hell. Come on, give me some siege battle music. Okay, there we go. What's up, STM?
Yeah, have a pretty decent amount of fan defenders there. Yeah, look at that. 27 peel. Jesus Christ. Yeah, this is what I don't know, sound like a, a, a quarter of them, they like decide they're gonna go the other way, and a quarter of the other guys decide they're gonna go the other way as well. Yeah, round one music. Maybe you can't really hear it from the you know, game sound. Well, the room one and the medieval two music, to be exact. Oh god, I'm stuck. Stucks? Yeah, I might need to like uh, work a little bit with the sound levels. Round two. I didn't really look, listen to the music in round two that much, to be honest. Because at that point I just always had a bunch of YouTube videos to watch. The, on like the second screen or something. Never paid much attention to the music. Or the in-game sounds, to be honest. I'd actually like to look into the Rome 2 music and add that as well. All oh, right. Um, what music am, am, am I gonna play with the Sturgia is Norse mod though? Like because a lot of stuff is copyrighted. I'm not sure if I'm gonna find something that's Viking-ish and not copyrighted as well. All oh, right, I didn't, I didn't bring another weapon. Two handed axe anywhere? An axe? No, not the sh shield, god damn it. Yeah, there we go. Wait a minute. Uh, oh, maybe I could use the music from. Uh, uh, no, not the Age of Charlemagne. The. What's it called? Uh, could you diagro for me, please, for one second? Uh, the, uh, what was the total war, but uh, Lord uh, Sagas Brit Britannium, Lord, like Britannicum, what, whatever the, co the one was called. Maybe there's some Vikingish music over there. Saxon and all Saxons and all that. It looks like they broke. I mean, I would use battering and some metal music, but um, copyright and all that. You'll never know when they're gonna decide to be like, oh, hey, copyright strikes, and boom, you're gone. Oh, 
actually surprised I survived this long. And the fever ray intro? What, uh, what, what do you mean? Uh, the Hellworld, uh, the Britannia, Britannia. Saga, Brit Saga's Britannia. Oh, what? Oh my god. Love getting pushed. Thrones of Britannia. Yeah, right. <laughs> I fucking remember the name of the game. Right, Thrones of Britannia. They had. There might be some music in there. Although, although I don't think I actually bought the game. I think I played it on early access somewhere. Or well, like, not early access, but like a free weekend or something. As well, I did play Crusader Kings 3, but I think it was like a free weekend or something as well, since I don't have it in my library. I had a heart for it. I'll, I'm not sure if the music from... Uh, I think the music from the show is copyrighted. I think I had it somewhere. Like in the earlier playthroughs. And it got copyrighted. No, it's gonna take forever to break through their shields now, at this point. I went to look into some, like, Norse free to use me. Actually, I do know, uh, like, a Croatian guy who has, uh, has, like, a ton of Viking music on his... Well, he creates Viking-ish music. Celtic. On his channel, on YouTube. Maybe I'll see if I can contact him to use his music or something. I'll link you the channel if you want to, like, hear his stuff. That's pretty good. I think it was Philip Lachkovic or something like that. Philip Macedon. I wish I could like lick off the fucking thing. Nope, never mind. The yeah, this guy. No, 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 no retreat, no surrender. Oh, look at all these level ups, Jesus. 14 kills, damn. That guy has some pretty good music. Maybe he'll give me permission to use it. Maybe. If I credit him and all that. Which I always do. Anyway. That's it for the Norsemen. None of them. Barbarians. Or the Brits. Oh no, not Brits. Bretons. Bretons and Picts. Would be the words for them, right? I'm actually surprised there's still food in the settlement considering we starved them out, kind of. A little bit. Yeah, that's it. And their war exhaustion is at 100 already. Looks, let's, uh, yeah, look at that. The Scythians only have two cities, but they have a shitload of castles, though. 
Armor is being besieged already by one by one of our guys. Good. Yeah, the map is pretty much conquered more or less. There's nothing stomping us. Stomping us? Nothing nothing is gonna stomp us out. Okay, disband the army. Not much to do these days. For now. Oh, that's good. I'm gonna grab it for myself, then gift it to someone. Give it to these guys. Easy peasy. 10 million in the bank. Nothing to spend it on. <laughs> uh, tons of influence. Nothing to... Well, I guess we can look through the policies, right? Well, that's about it. Nothing much. Not much else to do with these. Antons. And why would they not want this? Well, tax income is reduced, I guess. Not much else to do. I do love how all of these are... Still up. Even though... Like, being an independent clan. Like, no. Actually, that's what I should do. I, like, I should step down as the emperor now. I've done what I'm supposed to do. <laughs> I conquered the whole map. There's nothing else to do. Except auto-resolved through the last battles and the last... Uh, we can declare a war on the Scythians already. What about the Dacians? We can declare war on them as well. Let's give our guys some time to like replenish and I'm gonna go get some more troops. Then we're gonna circle back to the Scythians and finish them off. Out resolve through them. Unless they actually like attack me at that, po at that certain point. You know, anywhere on the field with an army. So we can have a big battle. Let me switch these also. I don't actually forgot uh, Gladius. Wait, no, no, not Gladius. Uh, the Sparta. Who the fuck are you? You know what? Hope I can, hope I can catch him and kill him. I don't think I can, though. Well, yep. Yeah, there's there's no way, literally. Look at the speed on them. Like, an army moves at 5.0 speed. How are you supposed to, like, catch any of them? Unless you have, like, a have only army, I guess. But then again, this is more or less done. There's not much else to do except how to resolve through all these. No negation. Oh, we might get a war now. Oh, look at that. Ask and you shall receive, right? I guess it's time to go at, to war with Dacians. Kill them off too, as well. God damn, these army notifications are freaking annoying at this point. Grab all the skirmishers. And let's make our way west. 
you still have a decent amount of territory, to be honest. I do love how most of my armies are like on the opposite side of the map. It's gonna take me forever to get over there too. I had to actually like go and compile all the music from the old Total War games. Do need to find them all and like put them in one folder. Maybe make playlists out of them. The background music. Actually, let's check. Let's let's hear the music from this. You know the vanilla music, if there is any. Is it good? That is. Oh yeah, very peaceful when we're at war. I'm sure if I'm gonna make it there in time to see... Oh, oh, are is there gonna be like a massive army outside of Sergoth so we can actually jump in and have a defensive battle? Please, 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 please. I think I only had like... I think I only had like one defensive battle this playthrough, to be honest. Yeah, this is what I mean. The music plays and there's a whole lot of dead air in between the songs. You gonna help? Yeah, go help. Okay, let's see the let's hear let's let's see with our ears the battle music hey, look at the spawns man look at look at this bullshit like we're right next to each other Over the defending army. Fine with that. I do love being the defensive army, right? Inside the UI. What's up, Plum? For Shiva Gaming, right? I'm not liking the music in this game, to be honest. But I'm gonna be, can't really hear it, right? I did forget their cav is actually pretty decent at killing enemy or our guys in the infantry. Because they get the two end of the whatever the fuck it is. I 
Yeah, I mean, music is not bad, but... Uh, from Palia. I think it's pronounced like that, right? I mean... I'm not English, so... Who knows? Uh, did the Sturgia is Norse mod actually like add in uh, like a, a fancy new battle axe or something? Like a berserker or battle axe or something? You played a little bit of Red Dead Redemption and you're back to the way for. <laughs> Why did you did you not like try out every possible focused focused uh, yeah focused direction in the Hearts of Iron? Oh, they did add the battle a fancy battle axe. So that's gonna be nice. Although I'm gonna die all the freaking time. I don't need any swing damage. Jesus. So basically one shot everything, right? Okay, that's saved. Once ransomed prisoners. Maybe I should try a, a besieging stuff on my own, right? Since I have 500 troops. Should be close enough. A, de a decent amount. Besieging... Druimor Castle. So that's one. And Canoc. Okay, this guy... The other guy gave up, apparently. No? I'm trying to the city. So let's grab the... Oh god, it's gonna take him forever to get here. Let's grab them and take care of the Dacians. Publis. There's the Plum Plumbum clan. Max clan tier. I think it's six. Oh no, five. Right? I'll, I'll check now. I'm not actually sure. Does it go on forever? Or is like six the max one? Give me a charm. So let's put the point into one hand since we don't use a pole arm at all anymore. Let's go clear out this area, then we're gonna swoop into their lands. I just left another one of them go, like a moron. Let's see. You got an idea where you're gonna go? No? Okay, let's siege this down. Or is he gonna see? Where is he going again? Or one of our guys just got wrecked there. Okay, he's besieging them. I'm gonna besiege this. Well, are you gonna be on tomorrow, Sammy? We're gonna be a normal human being and go out during the weekend. Like me. That's a. What, what we do here is we go out on a Tuesday because that's the sensible thing to do. When no one's out, you go out. Have a seven beers and wish you never did drank seven beers. Because you got old and you can't drink anymore. <laughs> and then again, like the first stream for Viking playthrough is just going to be me running around killing bandits, more or less. Since I'm going to start it on the 
Highest difficulty? What time? Uh, wait, uh, is uh, what what time is it over there? It's uh, half past midnight here, so at around nine in the evening. I am GMT plus one, I believe, still. Something like that. Where's my music? Goddamn game music. Give me game music. Look at that, they already took it. Look at this guy, the butcher. Cruel, devious, and close fisted. Serve as a soldier. Uh, is it gonna mesh? Like, uh, I mean, adding so many mods might just uh, fuck up a game, I'd, I'd say. You know? But I guess I could do that as well. I mean, I'll download the mods tomorrow during the day and see if all of them work together. But I have the AI over. Change culture mode party. So, uh, distinguished service, fill stacks, a realistic battle. Uh, the, you know, AI for the uh, party overhaul thing. True combat, right? Uh, was the bet better loot another one? Or battle looting or something like that? You got 30 mods without the game crashing. Oh god damn, you're lucky. Like, I mean, uh... I installed the the fire arrow mod and just kept crashing the game. For I don't know what reason. And such a simple mod as well. So fill stacks, realistic battle, true combat, sturgy eyes norse, banner pace, serve as a soldier, and of course the improved garrison uh, distinguished service and AI overhaul. I think that's it. Not gonna add any more of nothing not gonna add any more. Uh, you uh, there's a, a link to my guild server in the in the description, you know, for the YouTube. I think you can uh, you know just link them all in there in general chat or wherever. Or I, this is why I love Gilded. Gilded. Uh, I can make a like next playthrough on the forums. Now let's see. Create a topic. Thurgia. Thurgia is Norse. Play. Add mods here. I can basically create like a forum, a mini forum, and you can add like all the stuff you want. All the mods you want on, on there. Or I just made a you know I made a made a mod list for Bangalore. You can add all the mods in there as well. I mean, I got Discord too, if you want to use that, but... Discord, blah. I don't like it at all anymore. It's a pain in the ass to look through if you need to find anything. My server. How do I copy my user ID again? This it. Okay, so either on Gilded or do you want me to sell, send you my uh, Discord user, user ID 
or do you want me just to, uh, do you want to me to add you on Steam or the other way around? You add me on Steam. Can work both. Both of those can work. Okay, yeah, the butcher is gonna get more from the Plum Bum Clan, of course. The Plum Bum Clan is too good. Let's actually see. Uh, clans. No, I'm surprised they only have six, uh, like four. Well, they don't tend to have many members, do they? Unless there's a shit ton of like sisters and brothers in a clan, grandfathers and all that. Stupid that the, the uh, YouTube like removed the thing where you can actually like message people, PM people, you know. I could mod you, I guess. Or actually, you can just link all the all the mods in a. Uh, you know, in the chat or in the comments of any video, actually. That can work too. I don't know why the battle UI like removes the things that you get here. Like, ooh, that got hit. That didn't get hit. And all that. No, oh, they only have a. Let's all resolve this. I didn't notice they didn't have. They had like zero troops in there. Okay, since the music is not that good. Let's actually increase the volume a little bit. There we go. A mercy. And I just took it for myself, did I? Uh, what's it called? Yeah, this one. Let's give it to the... Antony clan? Maybe I should have dumped the prisoners in first. the music in game leave that to like 50 you know what's the next target save these guys who the fuck are you now oh right that's the guy who declared war on me that's taken already nice um I guess this one. They have sir. Is it besieged again? The butcher. The names. Jeez. The Mactator and all that. Actually, we do have one that's the Mactator, which is butcher in Latin, I think. If I remember correctly. Oh wait, yeah, the game bugged out and it's telling me it's being besieged, but it's not. That's nice. Okay, he's besieging that. You are traveling. You are traveling. He's going to a point. Traveling. 
Let's just go that way. actually attack him since there's some yup okay we got to save him if we get in there in time oh i don't think we will what what's rebel this time yeah you pieces of shit okay let's try and get there in time It's a river battle. And we are the defending side. Oh. There's a hill behind us behind us. Perfect. Uh, maybe I should have moved no, we couldn't we didn't get very far forward, to be honest. Actually, let's just charge in. There's no point in staying here, to be honest. We outnumber them by so much. for the follow of Sokan. I'm actually surprised I got that hit. Ooh, I know what I should do. I, should do. I caught the Viking playthrough. Let's go on full on, like, uh, realistic. No UI at all or anything. Let's see, let's see what the what are the other options again? We have a message with a screenshot. Yeah, on what though? You know, Jid is hosting me. Nice. Well, I did watch Jid like since 2017 or 18. I think like the first stream I uh, jumped on of his was uh, when he was playing a. Uh, I think it was in the Polonic Wars or something. Or a mod it's like in that period for Warhammer. Uh, Warband. Gilded. Let me just check. Uh, Or maybe it didn't appear yet. Twenty eighteen. Now you can. Uh, I'll be on his stream later on if he streams today. We can check uh, my follow age then. I just don't have the time to like watch him because he's, uh, you know, he streams when I sleep more or less. You know? You four is Ethiopia. <laughs> oh, he doesn't stream today? Oh, too bad. I don't want to see him play on the rail. That's going to be fun. See him do unarmed on it, in it. See how far he gets. 
the way he runs into the spiders or whatever the hell are they called I can't remember in the tunnels on the stream on Fridays right on Fridays he goes like uh, rejuvenates himself because you know he is a thousand years old at this point right Did we win this battle? No, there's of course stragglers running around. Yeah, I know what's so I jump on from time to time, although I lurk most of the time. Because I'm a quote unquote editing, editing the videos together. And by that I mean just cutting cutting the videos for YouTube. The median legionary? What do you mean, Sammy? The dictatorship, yes. Uh, I was on uh, yesterday when he got pissed off at Pendle. Wait, wait, wait. Was it yesterday or was it the day before? Yeah, the, the day before when he was pissed off at Pendle. Then he played uh, Paris now. And it was yesterday for the Atom game a little bit. Numidian Legionary. No, I'm not the Numidian Legionary. I'm the AP. Sammy. The console or whatever on the Gilded. Which one are you so I can, I can like push you up in the ranks? Yeah, I was there. The 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 the, the, the pathfinding kind of screwed them over on the on the siege battle, which was too bad. I wish uh, Jinxy, <laughs> Jinxy, okay. I'll find you later on, but I'm a, a P. With the P, with the P, you can say it's uh, well, I can't, why can't I remember? Like Greek P or Cyrillic, I guess you could say. I do plan on playing Prophecy of Pandora because. You know, seeing Grid play it again kind of like made me want to play it again. I just don't have a quite a good idea what. Uh, look at that jewelry. What uh, gimmick I'm gonna do this time? I did play through it like a Roman faction. I did play through it like a Fearsway, you know, with Fearsway. And I did, you know, create it, you know, Kingdom of Pandora and all that. Like I don't know what's. What should I do next? You know, what's the idea gonna be? I guess I should just join the Jashar. Become a skirmisher archer. Blah. You'd go out in your own? You would form a faction, which I did. Um, uh... I mean, Raven's Turn is decent, but it's like, you know, just vanilla, you know, uh, not vanilla, but like, you know, standard infantry and all that. I need to find some like other stupid decision to do. Inf infantry only, so I get wrecked, right? Sammy. I was thinking of uh, making a faction, well, 
but would have to like added the troops again. Do the char, yeah, that's that could be an idea. But like, I, I hate skirmisher cat. I hate him. I hate him with all all my being. I hate skirmishers in all the games, Total War and this. But playing as them would be would be something. All right, I need to increase cohesion. Yeah, the Shah has these basically archer cav and heavy cavalry. Nothing else to them. I was thinking of like actually making a faction, like going into the files, going into the files and making a uh, like a blunt only, like the you know the Inquisition that runs around, like uh, make some like a faction oriented uh, around them. But you could like go into the Pandor troop trees and switch out the weapons for blunt weapons. Actually, actually, you can make the ar archers and the crossbowmen have blunt, uh, blunt bolts and blunt arrows. So that could work out, you know. So mod I did make a prophecy of Rome sort of thing. There's a, there's a playlist on my channel somewhere. You find it real quick. The question is, if I, did I leave? Oh, that's on Twitch. Never mind. A second. I did go in and like change all the troops for the back empire. So I'm or and, and the names for the troops for the back empire. So it's the Roman Empire. Basically, it is like what it sounds, of course. You know, the Roman legionaries, such, well, I didn't name Sagittarius, but archers. What's your will? Yeah, this. Mm -hmm. I don't think it's gonna get ported, man, so. <laughs> or it's, at least it's gonna be a while. And a roll, man. I mean, I'm gonna look through all of them. If which ones I can get to work. Just north lords. Yeah, okay. Diplomacy. Is, oh, Jesus Christ. True battle loot. Yeah, true relations. Smith forever. More looters. More looters. Really? Uh, there is a mod that actually adds in uh, Prophecy of Pandor like troops. Into Ben Lord. Oh, yeah, but like when was that, Ahsoka? That was like, like a million years ago. I think when that was the statement from the mothers. Uh, this guy on the on the on next mods actually like made a pretty decent looking mod for War ban uh, Banlord with the troops from um, Prophecy of Pandor. It's not bad. I didn't play it yet though. Even added the demonic magnuses and all that last year. Ooh, good then. I think, we, uh, but I do think we need to like wait at least while like. Uh, Two, ye two more years until like all the fancy mods come out. I mean, there is the old realms mod, which uh, is Warhammer, and which added magic into the game. So that one's pretty good. And unfortunately, like uh, you can wipe a half an army off the map from a with a fireball, you know. So. Okay, so this is only a culture, I guess, a custom culture. I'm not sure how the remnants of Endoria mod actually works. That's a Pandora inspired culture in the game called Endoria that allows the player to start the kingdom with unique. Un Ooh. What 
for the fans of the mods Prophecy of Pandor and Perizno as well. Pandora recruit, militia, light bowman, and nobleman. This could be interesting. I never really like uh, went into the sandbox. What's up, Brian? YouTube. I never really like went into the sandbox and like started, you know, my own kingdom and all that. But this looks decent. Turn options, yeah. Yeah, this could, could be good. The playthrough. Yeah, yeah, definitely. We, we need to give like Bannerlord a little bit more time because, I mean, when Mountain Blade came out, or well, Warband came out in 2010, we didn't have mod like, we did have mods pretty quick, but uh, you know they're shit compared to the, the ones that are fully updated now. You know, we just yeah, give it time, you know. But uh, but that's the good thing as well. It gives you a reason to like come back and play the game again, you know? Once a mod gets updated or something or released. Now let's fight one battle out, why the hell not? Well, this is a castle. Why well, I ever saw one? Wait a minute. There's one wall bridge. Where the, where the fuck's the other one? Yeah, see a semi. Hopefully, I'm gonna get all the mods to work. Well, most of them. I'm not sure how how the early days of Pandora were. I think I got like into the uh, into Pandora when it was already like on the 3.1, 3. Point something, you know. I didn't get like in the, in into the earlier versions, unfortunately. Good night, Sammy. By the way, like, where's the other breach? Am I missing something? I can unwind. Okay. Forward. Yeah. Where the? Well, let me actually check out where the breach is. After all, I'm gonna assume it's one on on. There's one on this side. Oh yeah, there is. Okay, so plant a bunch of archers here to get shot at. Uh, imagine if this was uh, in a uh, warband, like you can drag out the line where the troops are gonna stand. Jid wouldn't have died on the siege then, since you could actually like place archers in below the walls at that point. Archers! You stay in front of here. But this is like, uh, I'm like l late, late game and there's like no resistance to me, more or less. I can roll, uh, roll over everything without a resolve. At this point, one of the hardest difficulties as well. Oh, what the f Okay, that's good. Archers are set up correctly. Now for the infantry. But this is a castle, not like the other ones. It always looks like you're besieging a city, not a castle. I do love. Uh, I do remember the days in Pendo 